Lisa D'Souza joins us live at 17th and Logan. Lisa, there's been violence at this camp, a double shooting. The mayor says something needs to be done. The question is, are these sidewalk tent encampments viable and safe or not? Well, according to the city, they are not. And that is exactly why we are seeing this sweep that is expected to happen today with just about 24 hours notice. So we know that campers living here in the blocks just behind us here, they have been told that they need to clear out their belongings by 10 o'clock this morning. And again, they were given about 24 hours notice, which certainly goes against what the mayor's goal was, is to give seven days notice. However, there are concerns about violence. We are told this is all coming from the mayor's office. Uh, the mayor's office saying that the quick action coming after a shooting in the area on Monday. Now, a spokesperson for the new mayor says the goal here, again, is to give campers seven days notice ahead of a sweep. However, safety fears for people in the area simply proved too dire in this instance. But for some local advocacy groups, people disagree. I think that if they believed that there was a dangerous situation, you would have acted immediately in one second. So giving this 24 hour notice, that's just an excuse. Those people deserve a seven day notice. Well, several advocacy groups we know plan to be here this morning. We are learning that the process of clearing this area out could start as soon as 7 a.m. Of course, we're going to be on top of it live, bringing you the very latest as it happens. Live in Denver, Lisa D'Souza, Daybreak on 2. All right, Lisa, we'll see whether there might be protesters there or how the mayor addresses uh, the idea that normally he didn't want to sweep these tent cities. Instead, he wanted to offer a place for these folks to go. But clearly there's urgency. Appreciate yeah. that report. And Travis and I can tell you, we live right there. It's mm -hmm. not safe. When